But do you find this the most troubling section for the LSAT when you come across, when you talk to students? Well, it varies from student to student. I think, I think that logic games is the scariest section at first, but like I said, it is the most learnable and the most perfectible actually. Reading comprehension tends to be harder to improve upon significantly because you've been reading your whole life and habits are deeply ingrained. And so if you find that you're struggling with reading comprehension, I would definitely give that more time. And the nice thing about the LSAT is that there are nearly 100 released exams, so there's plenty of material out there for you. There's four games per exam and four reading comp passages per exam. So if you wanted to, you could complete 400 games and 400 passages before you took the LSAT, and that would set yourself up for maximal success if you reviewed those problems in depth. So it's really a question of exposure and pattern recognition so that when you encounter a new game or passage on the exam, you're not totally thrown for a loop. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.